What is going on everybody? Eric coming to you guys again with another voiceover. A quick little uh, few clips from my last session and this was on Tuesday morning. I got some spinning in and front squats and some additional leg work which I didn't film. Uh, yeah, it's pretty insane that lately I've just been feeling really really good and uh, also feeling a lot more vascular which is something that's uh, really uh, not completely new to me but just in all areas I'm not really used to it but other other things are just feeling really good lately so I'll go into it in future videos but thought I'd mention it right now did work up to 195 for a triple during this uh, session which was awesome and uh, like I said I did some additional work I did some single leg presses other unilateral work I did some lunges with that and uh, yeah it's just the energy is just crazy so um, but granted this was a uh, fasted session in the morning so but yeah, uh, after that I worked at 165 and then did 195 for a triple right here. Uh, not filming too, too much lately. Uh, this is just a few different various sets. So other than that, it was an awesome, uh, awesome session. Noticing a lot of strength gains and that's what we're hoping for. So <laughs> uh, anyways, guys, enjoy the rest of the video. Peace. I just want to say apples are amazing. Time to make a vegan calzone. Let's do it. Look at that. All right, what's up guys? We're doing a live stream right now. I'm about to try this vegan calzone um, on camera for you guys, but everybody right there, no one's really in yet because it just started, but see my little setup going on right there. That's that. 
Oh yeah. Game changer. Alrighty guys, what we have here is the new limited edition pumpkin puffins. <clears throat> now we're gonna see how this tastes. Normally I'm not a fan of puffins, but I am a fan of pumpkin somewhat since the season is coming. Give these guys a little shot. Only five grams of sugar. I mean, hey, I'm trying to keep it light, so it works out right. No almond coconut. Now, we shall see. Made with real pumpkin. Um, I don't know. The huge, the biggest thing, the biggest thing with puffins with me is that the consistency or the texture. I always feel like it's super grainy. Like the peanut butter puffins are super grainy to me. And I do not like them at all. These are the best puffins I've ever had, by far. Um, I feel like. Seven out of 10, very good. Um, considering I do not like to eat a lot of pumpkin flavor products because I did a, a binge eating pumpkin phase for a, a huge time of my life. And, uh, but these actually, I really, I was hesitant buying them at first. But, out of all the pumpkin things right now that are coming out, like the pumpkin spice lattes at Starbucks and pumpkin spice almonds and everything, I would go buy this first because this is very, 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 very good. So give it a shot. If you like greeny, it's still pretty greeny, the texture of it. If you like cereals that are pretty um, uh, grainy and still somewhat airy at the same time, give this a shot. <laughs> 